Today's gonna be a different video than usual because we're not talking about, you know, a review or something else, but we're talking about the latest Galaxy Unpacked. And to be more specific, we're talking about this kidney bean earbuds. Yes, this is the Galaxy Buds Live. We're going to talk all about it because I have it reordered and I have a ton of video idea to make with it when it comes later this early September. Let's get into it. Selamat pagi! Good morning everyone, Kenneth here and yes, today while we take a look at the Samsung website about Galaxy Buds Live, are you excited about the Galaxy Buds Live and me checking out, you know, more expensive, more established options right there? Like this one is the Sony WF-1000XM3's um, $230 bucks, and this one is significantly undercutting it at $170 bucks, you can see right here. Yes, I know I noticed this is not exactly Apple to Apple's comparison as well as the AirPods Pro which is $250. Bucks. That's an in-ear design that's designed to you know really separate you from uh, your outside noise unless you turn on transparency mode but this one is designed to you know just block the low frequency rumbles and I think Huawei also does the same thing with one of his earbuds if you know the exact model let me know down in the comments below let's scroll through the website here yeah a design that's unheard of uh, yeah yeah my goodness can I call this the kidney bean earbuds from now on <laughs> It does really look like a kidney bean. Talking about the design real quick here. So one thing that I noticed the most is you have this, um, how do you call it? Like these ones. Uh, these are vents, air vents. And we're going to see that later. Three mics, not two mics. So we have one to the outside and we're going down to your mouth. I think this one is the one mic that tries to get closer to your mouth. And there's another mic, just like the Galaxy Buds Plus, and I think. That's some crazy mic setup there. So we're definitely going to check out how it performs in the call test later on. And also check this out. If you can see here, this is an optical sensor that will detect if you're wearing it or not. So, you know, the auto play and pause thing. We can see that on the top here, there's like a little, like, they, I think they call this a wing tips, even though it's not shaped like a wing at all. It's more like a, how do you call it? Like what? I, I don't know. Anyway, let's move on. This one, they give you a couple different sizes so that you can change it and get like the perfect fit for you. That's very interesting. Usually half in ear earbuds like this, they don't have any kind of support. Basically the support is just that plastic that goes into your ear but right now there are two kinds of support so I think that this design will be the best design for any half in ear uh, but we're going to see that that's one of the reason why I'm so excited about this and also just the colors just like a Note 20 Ultra black white and then the mystic bronze yeah that's the mystic bronze what do you think what color should i get i'm thinking of getting the mystic bronze anyway so this is what it looks like when it's worn and yeah it looks perfectly fine like all the mic placements even though it looks weird when you just look at it, but when you wear it yeah it looks perfectly fine and it's definitely very shiny oh my goodness uh moving on to the next one a and c yes this is another like big feature but this a and c will be different than your usual a and c's you know because it only blocks low frequencies so if you want to block you know voice chatters and stuff like that this is not going to do it but this thing will work best when you have a low rumble like an air conditioner bus engine sound you know like a plane engine bus engine stuff like that i'm definitely looking forward to how anc will work on a design that doesn't separate you from the outside world next one is the 12 millimeter speakers that claims to have like the 12 millimeter speaker is pretty standard for a half in ear sometimes they go to 13 or 14 millimeters on realme earbuds the difference here is oh yeah if you can see here they have a bass duct right here so that will definitely enhance the bass reproduction you know because the air will move like more i think <laughs> correct me if i'm wrong i'm not really sure about how these things works but i'm really interested to see how it sounds as well but the next interesting thing is the air vents right here so you have air vents 
that passes through air from the inside through the outside just like the airpods pro and this is the second time ever i've seen air vents of any kinds i've tried the airpods pro before on an apple store and it does feel like you're wearing nothing something like the Huawei t19 mifa x5 uh, those have really sucked in feeling that probably might not be very comfortable for some of you with this kind of air vents on an already open design i think it will help to make it more comfortable than ever so very very cool and let's check out the battery life here non-stop listening up to eight hours yeah that's really nice that's really nice and up to 29 hours okay so i'm kind of betting that the inside of these case are like 500 milliamp hours something like that pretty decent there eight hours is i think without anc on and with anc it'll be six hours or something like that if i remember correctly and you can see here this is the note 20 ultra i'll have a review for that coming as well later this month so yeah i'm really excited to review like finally a review another phone and um, an ultra premium phone at that. Anyway, moving on, charging. Usually these don't matter much to me because, you know, these kind of earbuds charge pretty quickly anyway. So five minutes can get you around one hour of play time. And moving on to the next one, best in class call quality. We've talked long about this already. One mic down here, another mic up here and there is also this inner mic that i was talking about and finally a voice pickup unit so this is what i wanted to talk about it senses your jaw when your jaw is moving i think it's more like an a gyroscope of something as my jaw vibrates this data is converted to voice signal so it's kind of like a reverse of you know the bone conduction thingy so it takes the bone vibration and then converts it to voice that's insane tech so i'm really looking forward to see how that will perform and if possible right if possible i will buy an airpods and make a comparison with it so we're going to take a look at that hopefully sometime near in the future i'm really excited okay so touch controls hopefully this will have everything bixby i don't really care about it sorry and um butts together yeah this is like the airpods when you can share more than like two pairs of earbuds when you and your friend has galaxy buds you can connect to the same phone and listen to the same thing that's pretty cool samsung has its own pop-up with the case but at this price i think uh that's a given right <laughs> and also you can see here this is important android and ios compatible the galaxy wearable app will be available on ios and android so i'm looking forward to see the customization of the controls see if it has everything like starting from play pause music controls next or previous song and also volume controls so yeah definitely getting my hopes up for that and also pairing with pc it supports this thing called swift pair on windows 10 so you just open it up and you know it will pop up as a notification that's very very cool and um yeah that's pretty much it about the galaxy buds life interesting so yeah that's pretty much it for the rundown of the galaxy buds life not sure if this is you know like if you want to see more of these kinds of videos but this is me basically just talking and sharing my opinion about the earbud but what is very interesting is when you use the galaxy buds live alongside the samsung galaxy note 20 i think the 20 ultra is because when you record videos right not many people knew this and they just take it for granted that okay the earbuds have mic so i can record a video and probably like record someone with my phone give them my earbuds and somehow they will pick up the voice from the earbuds microphone to the video that i'm recording right but no that is wrong most phones they won't let you do that the microphones are only used for phone calls or voice chats in game you know stuff like that video calls never to record videos but here on the galaxy note 20 ultra i discovered something really cool so you can see here let me scroll down a little bit so here it is the microphone control and you can see here connect your phone to a bluetooth microphone like any galaxy earbuds 
or they don't say it here, but you can connect any Bluetooth earbuds and use it as a microphone. The thing is, most earbuds microphone are not good enough. If you can see on the call quality comparisons, right? I think that's like the best they can do and that's not good enough to record videos. So if you want to record clean audio like what I'm recording right now, um, I'm really excited to test this one out. You can see here, so you can isolate your subject's voice. That's more like a, you know, using a laugh mic that you attach it right here. But now your subject will be wearing an earbuds and the microphone will be on the subject's ear. So if I scroll down here, let's see, that's like foot, footer, footer, nah, how do you call it? Like foot foot something. <laughs> Check this out. For optimal audio quality while recording, please use Samsung Galaxy earbuds. That doesn't only include Galaxy Buds Live, but you can also use Galaxy Buds Plus and Galaxy Buds OG. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to see how this one will perform. Is it gonna be better than, you know, just you holding the phone and, you know, let your microphone on the phone itself do it? We're gonna find out later. So yeah, definitely subscribe for that. Thank you so much for watching. That's actually everything that I wanted to say on this one. So let me know down in the description below what do you think of the Galaxy Buds lineup, Galaxy Buds Plus, Galaxy Buds Live. Remember, don't forget to subscribe because we're going to test out the Note 20 Ultra as well as the Galaxy Buds Live later on this month. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Kenneth and I will see you in the next one. Bye.